the injury um, happened uh, the 12th of February it was, I think, we played to in um, I fractured my clavicle in, in four places, you know, so it took um, a long long time to heal and they stuck a metal plate in with some screws and to be fair, they told me straight away that it was going to be 10 to 12 weeks sort of injury and um, it's dragged on and dragged on and but it's it's uh, coming up to 12 weeks now, you know, so I'm, I'm just about ready to play, so... Um, it's been frustrating missing out on the games, but ready to go again now. Straight away after the injury happened, basically, because the doctor he came up to me and he informed me straight away. And the first thing on his his thing was like, it's going to be two or two or three months, but you will be fine by the Euros. And that was before I'd even got around to asking me, you know. So, um, in that sense, the club have been brilliant with me. They not tried to rush me back, and they um, they want me to be able to to play in the Euros and. Um, so I didn't really have any fear that I was ever going to miss it because the people that was looking after me were, were brilliant and they were ultimate professionals and I knew at every stage I was feeling exactly what they told me I should be feeling so it was okay. To play I think at the, the top of your yeah, game is the most important thing and playing in international tournaments for, for your country is, is as big as it gets and we'll go and everyone will see how much it means to us all uh, it's the pinnacle of a career really and it's a, it's it's not gonna it doesn't happen all the time you know I mean with Ireland I think it's over 20 years since we've qualified for the Euro so if it's another 20 years we'll all be retired and we'll all be cheering us on as fans so we want to go and enjoy it and make sure that the, the whole country enjoys it and gets involved in it it's probably unheard of that, that Ireland have a problem with a squad selection, you know, whereas usual, or a few years ago we were trying to find players to come, you know, and now there's there's so many of us who have played over the last uh, two or four or five years that the the disappointing thing is there's only 23 can go to the Euro, so it's uh, it's going to be heartbreaking for some people, but it does bode well for the future, and the, when the World Cup starts again in, in September the squad again is, is massive and we've got a great choice and a great selection to choose from. Marco and Giovanni have been brilliant for Ireland really in general when they they come in their their whole mindset was they were winners, you know what I mean? They knew how to win stuff and they knew how to organise teams and they've certainly improved us as a squad and um, as a team where we've just become a lot stronger you know and a lot harder to beat and I think that's a lot down to them. I'm here today to launch the Tree Ireland Samsung Supporters Kit. I think Tree's sponsorship of the of the whole of Irish football is important. They, every time someone, a customer joins they give some money back to it to clubs at, at grassroots level and I think it helps, helps football in general in the country and is, is very appreciated by, by us all.